Hey guys, it's your boy Millie Complete 3.0 back at it again with another motherfucking video. Hey bro, this is this is just is fucking part two to that uh, manga recommendation talking about waking up to find myself in another world. It's a manga I'm still reading, mind you. And remember, like I was talking about, all, bro. Look, look. I'm I'm just gonna keep it straight with you. I'm trying to I was trying to ease into it, bro. This shit is basically hentai. And the crazy part about it is that I'm not even. I'm not even deep in there yet, bro. I'm I'm into the chapters, bro. I'm reading them like at least daily, bro. I still haven't caught up, but I shit you not. I swear, every scene, every fight scene you have in there, and it's I'm I'm not gonna act like the fight scenes are like the greatest shit, right? It's an isekai. I mean, some of them be fire, but this one, you know, it's a standard. It's more into the fact that it's damn near hentai fucking manga, bro. And it's so crazy to me, bro. Like I can't, bro. I shit you not. If you at least half of the panel, like half of the chapter, right? Half the chapter is him going to the labyrinth, you know, fighting, earning new shit, learning, um, earning shit, you know, to cook with, to use this to make a bath or something. But at the end of the chapter, at least once each chapter, bro, either starts off with the character Roxanne. Remember I talked about her? That little doggy. And the crazy part, it's a harem at, uh, manga. I still haven't gotten to other girls yet, and it's still with fucking Roxanne. That's the crazy part to me. Just imagine when it comes to them too. This is just Roxanne we're talking about. So, all right, first of all, we got a scene. You know, he made this stipulation to Roxanne when they first said, I, I forgot that I left this shit out. Because it was crazy to me. And the crazy part, it literally, after that video, I literally, as I, cause I didn't finish that chapter that I was showing you, after, literally after, I made this video. I made that video, I should say. I scrolled down and he literally had a sex scene. Bro, I was fucking done, bro. I was like, oh my God, I should have finished this whole chapter before making that video because it just, bro, that's, this is crazy to me. And this is the first part of the harem. That's the crazy part about it. And I'm not gonna act like the manga is the best, right? It's, it's not the best. It can have a better story plot. But at the end of the day, when it comes to fucking sexual scenes and harem, bro, it's it's up there, my nigga. It's up there. It's fucking goaded, bro. I ain't gonna count. It's got it. It's not bad in high school days. I know that for sure. Monster Music Man, bro. It, it's not bad in all there, but bro. If it was in the top 25 or at least top 50, it's up there, bro. Like, that, matter of fact, I got a scene right here, bro. Literally why I'm on here again, bro. Look. Look. Look, bro. Look. Hold on. Let me, sc let me scroll, bro. Look, bro. You see it? Bro, look, bro. Hold up, hold up, hold up. They're just talking now. They're just talking now. But first of all, look at her, bro. Is she not fine? Is she not fine? Uh, what's she doing? Sucking his dick. That shit crazy to me, bro. Like, bro, like. I can't wait for the rest of the hair to come up because like the fact, he's doing so much, bro. He is doing so much just to have sex with this girl, bro. Everything he's doing is somehow related to Roxanne. Roxanne, Roxanne. But no, like, that's a good one. But like seriously, like he even made a stipulation that every time he wakes up, she must kiss him. Every time they go to bed, she must kiss him. I mean, she complies. She's submissive and breathable. You know what I mean? But like, she will do this. Like every time, I mean, every single chapter that involves him waking up, it's her kissing him every time. Because she'll wake up before him and start kissing him. Every time before they go to bed, have sex. Bro, I swear to God, it's in every chapter. And if it's not in one chapter, they make an entire chapter full filled with like him trying to um him having sex with her, bro. That ass. Bro, this fucking oh bro. Bro, this fucking manga is so fucking hilarious to me, bro. Like this this is 
I read a couple manga. I'm not gonna act like I'm a manga enthusiast, right? Yeah, I just got into manga this year. Not this year, but last year to actually start reading them. Not looking them up on YouTube. Actually getting an app for manga reader, right? This is the first manga I ever got. I mean, I'm, I'm reading Monster Music, man, so. Mm. I should make a manga recommendation, but people should know about Monster Music, man. But I'm gonna still pick it because views. But like, this is the first manga that I ever seen that is so emphasis on sex scenes, bro. Like, dead ass. Like, the first manga, bro. Like, this shit was it. Oh my god. Bro, I had a whole realization, bro. So, y'all seen Redo the Healer, right? I know you have, because I seen it and I watched all of it. Unfortunately, I kind of wish I didn't. And it's to the point, and World in Harem, even though that's a fucking trash ass anime. All this shit. And it's to the point that, like, they they put all those things, Redo the Healer and World in um, Harem, I said Syndrome, Harem into hentai anime because they was like yo you know we don't really have a good story plot but we have them sex scenes so we put this in hentai this shit will be a hentai they wouldn't even make it an anime just make it a fucking hentai dead ass you have no reason you have no reason to be a fucking anime i, I thought this could be an anime adaptation but the more i read it i'm just like nah no, bro. Because I was telling my friend, I said, yo, you should read this. He's like, yo, this damn. I showed him one of the panels and he was like, yeah, this damn man, hentai. And I'm like, yeah, you're right. You're right. And this this is the first girl. He's supposed to have like three others, I'm pretty sure. Because I'm pretty sure when I made the fucking um, the title card for the other video, it showed that I picked it up from Google, right? Because that's why I usually get my title cards. And it had three other girls. Bro, this is not the end of the harem. This is the first one. And he's doing all this shit. Just imagine. Just imagine the other girls, bro. The other girls, bro. And this is, I want to say this is like the first hint. I mean, this is the first, I say hint, first manga that I ever had sex scenes in. Because this other manga I've been reading, it had, it, it doesn't have sex scenes, but. Them etchy scenes are fucking crazy, bro. Just fucking crazy. But like, ah, uh, bro, you should. I implore you to read this manga. If you don't, if you ever listen to me, you don't need to learn learn about the story. Cause story, be honest, is it's not all that good. It could be better. It could be better. But Roxanne, this way for the rest of the harem too, bro. Them scenes, bro. Them edgy scenes, bro, are are there, bro. Like they are worth it, bro. They are worth it. But that's all for me. I just wanted to make a part two for this bitch. You know what I mean? But Malik on Fleet Three Pointer out. This.